Let's go ahead and take a live look now at the Las Vegas Strip, which is now part of the Las Vegas Grand Prix racetrack, also called the circuit. Of course, the big reason to bring a Formula One race to Las Vegas is to attract a few hundred thousand visitors to fill up all 154,035 rooms here. Well, at last year's inaugural race, that mission was accomplished, but this year is starting to look like that may not happen. But according to a hotel and tourism insider with a huge following on X, the last three weeks could help Las Vegas take an F1 victory lap. The room rates were under $200. They were, you know, 50, 60, $70 a night. And now they're like 900, a thousand again. So, and as you know, all of our hotel rooms are um, demand priced. So if we all do a search for Cosmopolitan on Wednesday, it'll raise the price up. So that would indicate that the demand is increasing. So I think that the initial reports were that it's way down and now the, the markers are showing that there's some like late rally. Jennifer Gay says that it's also important to remind locals that the Grand Prix was deliberately scheduled to coincide with the slowest week of the year for tourism. So any financial improvements seen by businesses compared to the same week before the race is a bonus.